Hey everybody, welcome back to a brand new episode of Modded Superflat. Hope everybody's doing good. I'm doing fantastic. Guys, today is episode 15. I've got a great episode planned for you. Hashtag question of the day for today. Yesterday I asked you guys about PE and console and everybody was like all on the fence. So I'm kind of curious. What do you play more? Do you play PE more or do you play console more? Or do you play PC? In the comment section below, let me know which console you or which version of Minecraft you play a lot. As always, if you guys enjoy this series, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe. Turn on notifications for when the videos come out. Guys, let's get into the video. All right, guys. So welcome back. I have been pretty busy. Actually, you guys want to know, I, I, we were talking about this barn the other day and how I was missing items. Actually, I wasn't missing items. You know, the funny thing was, is I thought I made it 16. It was actually 17 long. So I had to remove one wall, which is why there's like grass out here. So I fixed all that. And then just because I'm super thorough, I went back through and I um, kind of got uh, all the information from the crops, like where they're aligned at. Now everything is perfectly in order. So, plus, not to mention, we are, we've got a lot of crops, guys. Look at all the mini sweet potatoes. We have a stack and nine. Um, lots of strawberries. We have almost over a stack of every single thing except for soybeans seem to be a little bit low. We don't have very much wheat. And then, so there's only a few crops that we don't, uh, there's not actually, the end crops are the ones that we're really missing the most of because this is just like a random assortment of stuff here. But we have a ton of stuff, man. So one of the changes that we're going to be making today is in our barn. Now, initially I was going to keep everything separated, but I'm quickly, quickly realizing that's probably not a good idea. So let's go over to the barn and we're going to fix some stuff here. So I've been breeding the animals as I've been playing. Go in here. So what I think I'm going to do is I think I'm probably just going to remove these. There we go. Now, I might keep the cobblestone in there because I think trying to... I was actually going to... I really wanted to put dirt in there. But I think trying to remove all that with all these animals standing here is going to be super tough. Same with over here. Look at the bunny rabbits. All right. So we'll remove all this. We also need to go check on the quarry real fast. See how that's doing. There we go. So now those guys can all intermingle together. Fantastic. So let's go check on the quarry. Um, I I don't think I messed with it since. Actually, I need to grab some food. So that's another thing that we need to do. We need to make food today because I am pretty much running low. I'm like eating cookies. Well, actually, I'll eat the bread. The bread's a little bit better. Bread, come to Jevin. There we go. I'm, I gotta be honest with you guys. The pack that I made for this, man, I am thoroughly enjoying this. So let's go and take a quick gander at what we got. Now, I did visit out here a little bit. Like, I'd say it's probably three hours ago. I've been playing in this world for a couple hours now. Um, I did delete a bunch of andesite. For some, the, the andesite has taken over the quarry, guys, and I'll show you what I mean. So it's probably stopped now. It's probably out of fuel, yeah. Look at all of the andesite, right? Like, I started mining on, like, just the biggest thing of andesite possible. <laughs> so I deleted all the andesite. We have 59 iron, 28 copper, 10, and then marble and limestone, things like that. Problem is, is that we have ran out of fuel um, to generate stuff. So I'm thinking, why don't we take a step back from that quarry for a second and make maybe a tree farm or something to run that off of? Um, shouldn't be too bad. I don't think we're going to be able to make the Ender Eye O one, but I think we can probably make an easy, easy tree farm from, um, Mine Factory Reloaded. So let's go ahead and get started on that right now. Um, I've been messing with this trap thing. I don't really know how this thing works, to be honest with you. I've been trying to figure that out because that gives you drops. So anyways, if we're going to make the tree farm from Mine Factory Reloaded, we need the Harvester first. So, ooh, that is, I wonder why that recipe is like that. That is a very, very tough recipe. I wonder what changes that recipe. What about the planter? Yeah, something, something inside of my mod pack is changing that recipe. 
And that's not, I wanted to have separate entities of that, so I'm not sure why that's doing that. I'm gonna actually look for that real fast. All right, guys, I think I fixed the recipes. Fantastic, they're good to go. Um, so I'm gonna probably push an update to this pack within the next two days for these uh, recipes. Um, it's actually a part of Ender IO is the issue, so that was the reason why we were having that. Um, actually, not Ender IO, but down in the config file, where things work uh it actually has a section for that so uh we need the harvester as well basically it asks you if you want to use um ender io based recipes and nobody wants to do all that nasty work for a planter and a harvester so there we go all right so we've got that taken care of Let's grab a little bit of cobblestone so we can make a rim around that. I'm gonna need saplings. We're probably gonna need some chests. Grab those. I know we're gonna need conduit. I don't know if I have any conduit left or not for. That might be enough. I actually think I'm probably gonna need to make more of that. So do I have any alloy? I have two. Let's go ahead and break those down into nuggets. I think I still need the binder though. Make a little bit of that. There we go. So we'll get that smelt in right now if there's anything, any juice left in this. Not really. Let's go ahead and just use the basic furnace here. Put one there. I'll put that all in there. There we go. All right. So while that makes that, I'm trying to think if there's anything else I'm going to need. They're going to need power. So we're probably going to need to make power conduit too. Power conduit, so we'll just use this one. That reuses conductive iron. That one uses that. So do I have any other alloys? I do not. All right. Um, let's see. That conductive iron is just redstone and iron. So that's a pretty easy recipe. Grab iron. There we go. I don't know if we're going to be able to make it, though, because I don't think we're going to have enough juice in there. I don't know. It's gonna. I think. It, does it make one at a time? I don't know, let that run. This is making binder, so put that in there. All right. So let's go ahead and make a little bit more conduit. There we go. It's gonna have enough. It's stuck at eighty-seven percent. Um. Do I have a generator? I don't have a generator here. Uh, can I make another generator? There we go. Um, some iron. Take half of that. Okay, generator. Then we just need a redstone block. There we go. There we go. All right, cool. That there. Put that there. And then I just need a little tiny bit of fuel. <clears throat> Excuse me. All right, so that's good to go. Uh, also, let's go ahead and sleep. It's not oh, peaceful, is it? No, I didn't think so. I haven't, I haven't seen a mob yet. That's why I was like a little curious. As soon as I get done recording this video, guys, I'm going on my daily walk. I think we're going to shoot for three miles today. Your boy's trying to get a 5K in this morning. All right, so we're just waiting on binder. I'm trying to think if there's anything else I'm going to need. Probably some kind of... Well, I guess if it's a furnace generator, that would take wood. So it could just burn the wood. I don't do saplings have a burn time? They do. So we'll um we may need a filter actually. It's a good thing I thought of that. Take a filter. Wow, this is slow. There we go. There we go. Okie dokie. So conduit. Make some basic energy conduit. There we go. Should be enough to work this out now. I think we got everything we need. So let's go do this thing. I think what we'll probably do is work backwards and just pump. Um, I think we'll probably have to use round robin. We should be able to get it to work. All right, so let's get rid of all this nonsense. I need a little bit of room here. 
And we can use this for future setups too. There we go. Okay, so to get started, we need to put the planter in the ground. So first off, we need to have conduit running to these guys. Just like that. Yeah. So then insert, insert, and we'll just have it. Actually, I think I'm gonna disable that one. Insert, insert, disable. So, and then insert. Okay, so those are all set to insert. We've got one running into each. We'll run a cable off that. There we go. Um, so that will run from the harvester's chest. So we'll put that right here. Wrong side. I always forget if the harvester is the way the harvesters plant. Wait, I can't pick that up. Currently harvester harvestable. Oh my god. I need to make a wrench. Hold on, we need some food. So you're telling me I can't pick that up with my pickaxe? Hold on. I don't believe you. I'm breaking it anyways. <laughs> I was gonna say, dude, like, that doesn't seem right. So put it right here. Chest right there. Conduit right there. Extract, uh, round robin. Filter, and then we only want to remove wood from that. So I'll need to chop a tree down real fast. Okay. There we go. Fantastic. So now that we got that set up, we need to put the planter in the ground. Uh, so one, two, three. Let's go ahead and remove all of this. Planter. So planter goes there. We're gonna need to run cable underneath of here. There we go. Hopefully there's enough power cable here. Phew, cutting it close, buddy. Cutting it close. Uh, then we need conduit. Right there, right there. Uh, I need to get down there and see that. So, conduit, extract, and put that right there. I don't think this can hold. So if I put that there, that should work, right? That doesn't have an internal buffer. Uh, it might actually need to be extracted from the chest. So put that there, put that there, put that there. And I'm out of... Uh, no, I, sh I should be fine. All right, so let's extract from the bottom. And extract. And then since that's got a plant in there, let's just go ahead and test this out real fast. That should have went into the furnaces. I'll have to change these to survive. Oh, no, 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 no. It's, it's I think it's working. Yep. Cool. So that's working. Then these should also have a no power. Probably just not enough power to go around, really. I'm going to turn this off for now. I think we're good to go. So we'll need to probably jumpstart the system a little bit here. Put saplings in there. Those should be put into the planter. Nope, they are not being put into the planter. That's weird. Oh, I needed to put logs in there, that's why. All right, let's try it one more time here. I think we got everything set up the way we need to, though. I think we got it. Cool. All right, so. Put the filter set up here. So extract only wood. So that means the other ones will need to go down. It's not extracting out of there, though. Why is that not extracting out? Extracting. And then it needs to be set to insert. Oh, there we go. There we go. So we just need to give it a little bit of power. Like this needs power. I'm assuming everything is still going to this, though. Yeah. All right, well, besides that, I think we're good to go. 
Um, I'm going to split this up into four. Kind of hoping that'll be enough to jumpstart it at least. Yeah, that's, uh, that quarry is taking a ton of power, though. I might have to move one of these and put it, like, right here. That might help the system run. There we go. So now if we had bone meal, I don't think we can... I don't think we can do that. So once those trees grow, I think we're good to go. So I'm going to watch this for a while and I'll be back. All right, guys, welcome back. So I tested this. It's working. I uh, might have to do something with the sludge, though. Uh, everything besides apples are being pulled out. The wood is doing round robin. Um, we might have to speed this up a little bit. I don't know. I don't remember if I have open blocks in this or not. I think we should probably make a sprinkler, though. Might work for us pretty well, I think. Because right now, this is just, like, not growing. But we do have a good amount of power. So there's at least a million power there. Everything is turned on. So when I flip this switch, it's probably going to lose all its power pretty much right away. And that means that this might lose power, too. I'm not sure yet. We'll see. It's running pretty quick, though. Doesn't this remind you of the old days, guys? Trying to figure out power for a quarry. So when those logs are harvested, it's going to take the saplings, put them downstairs, which it's doing. The logs are going to get put into the chest, and they're going to round robin into here. It would probably be better if we smelted them first, though. Because, like, logs probably don't do very much for power. Yeah. Yeah, we're not uh, we're not generating very much power with this, so we might have to introduce a smeltery here, or like a, a furnace or something. In the meantime, though, I'm not really worried about that. We have focused on that for enough for today. Uh, I want to make some food today, so let's go do that. Um, we've been running, living off bread. We have got so much stuff built up. I think we're pretty much good. The only things we don't really have are like um, like the craftable stuff, like butter. And things like that. And that's like more milk based. So today I think we're going to be making some food from chickens. Because we have a lot of chickens. And lots of eggs. So I just picked up 12 more. Let's go ahead and throw these in there. There we go. So let's kill some chickens. Poor little baby chicken. He's going to die in a minute. There's tons of baby chickens in here, too. I might have to load this area, I think. Ooh, you know what? I got an idea. I should probably be using my hammer. That gives looting. Ha ha! Success! Is that all the adult chickens? One more. There we go. So we got 20 meat. Yeah, whenever we kill them, we got to remember to use looting. There we go. So, we've got 20 raw meat. Obviously, we are going to be using cooked chicken. So, uses. Let's actually, first off, let's get over to the base. Smelt this down. And I think I actually have some raw chicken inside of this, too. Raw. Oh, I guess not. Anywho, put that in there. Put all this away real fast. So, chicken's cooking. What can we use this for? Um, so we've got a meat fiesta pizza. We've got a foot long, which does 23 hunger. The problem with that is, is I have all that. The wheat is a little iffy. If I have enough bones, I could probably make the foot long. Do I have any bone or bone meal left? A little bit. I might be able to make the footlongs. I'm not sure because we would need quite a bit of bread for that. And I have three left and we would need at least 20 bread. It's quite a bit of wheat. Do I have any wheat in here? I have 31 actually. There's 13. We can also check over here to see if I have any wheat. Uh, nothing in there. Nothing in there. Okay. So... I also want to look at the other foods real fast, but we might make the footlongs today. I was thinking maybe making chicken parmesan. 
So he uses uh, chicken taco. Chicken parmesan requires cheese. This one, oh, oh, chicken parmesan is not very good. Uh, that is hot wings. Those can't be very, oh, uh, hot wings are not bad. Creeper wings, I don't think those are, oh, that is Pam Tarvis Craft, hot wings. Hot sauce. Nope, I think we're gonna do the subs. So to make the subs, we're going to need our cutting board, bread, cooked chicken, lettuce, tomato, and mayo. Mayo is eggs and a juicer. Oh, that might not be good. Oh, I have 15 eggs there. Let's go ahead and go over to the chickens real fast and grab that. We'll also need to do this thing. Hopefully they've laid enough eggs or no eggs. Crap. All right, so first off, let's just see if we can do anything here. So that gives us five. We're definitely gonna need a bone meal. Let's keep doing this here real fast. There we go, 21 bread, 21 wheat, I mean. Sugar, how you get so fly. Okay, <clears throat> excuse me. So, unfortunately we don't have enough for as much as I wanna make. Uh, so we need to go over here real fast. Gonna need to grab a few things. We're going to need the cutting board and then the juicer. So the juicer with the eggs makes mayo. Really sucks, I wish I had five more eggs. Um, I know there's like a chicken wandering around here somewhere. I don't see him. And there's no eggs in here right now. You would think if I just stood here for a minute, I would probably get the eggs that I need. Uh, okay, what else do we need for chicken parmesan? We need to get um, cooked chicken, tomatoes, and lettuce. Okay, so we'll be able to do both of those, no problem. So let's do that real fast. And I am running out of food. Sugar high, you get so high. Got that song stuck in my head. All right, so tomato, tomato, tomato. So we need 20 of those, and then 20 lettuce, let me switch that, let's grab like 22, eat a little bit so we can walk, there we go, once again check the chickens, we need 5 eggs, I don't know where else we're going to get them from, pretty salty, I don't have any right now. Hmm. Lame. Have you laid an egg yet? No. So I guess we'll have to make 15 for now. And then once um once it becomes time, we'll make five more if we can. There we go. So let's see. Uh crafting table uses. So we just made oh, you can't make more than one at a time. What's going on? Uh, you, 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 you. There we go. So once we have the other mayo, we'll be good to go. Man, I wish I had five eggs. Let's go ahead and eat one. Dude, these things are OP. Holy crap, man. Our food, our food production is finally catching up with us, guys. This is exciting. Give me your eggs. I still don't have any. Crap. Ugh. All right, let me go put these other two things up real fast. So, can I use is the okay? Well, actually, before we before we just kind of write off the rest of these raw tofu egg, which is tofu and dandelion yellow. Uh, silken tofu comes from soybean so if we make the presser we may be able to make the rest the presser could come in handy later on anyways so how hard is it to make the presser uh i have no idea what it looks like 
Uh, there's only 400 pages of things here. Is it called a presser or a pressing? Uh, mayo. Hold on. It's called a pressing. No, it's called a presser. Oh, that's easy. I can totally make that. So we need to make two pistons. There we go. So there's the presser. Sleep real fast. Before all the baddies get us. So then we should be able to... I wonder how long it takes, though. That's the main issue I'm worried about. Okay. Because <clears throat> we have soybean. Grab a couple of those. That's not bad. We're going to need three more. There we go. So get those in there. So that makes that. We need to put it back in there to make the firm tofu. Hopefully that doesn't take a long time, though. Uh, all right. So there's five. So put that back in there. That's not too bad, actually. So we need dandelion yellow. Not sure if I have any flowers. I'm sure there's some way to make dandelion yellow. There's yellow plants right out here, so. That makes green. Okay, then. Anything else? I see yellow way out there. Add the creeper. At least we'll be able to finish the food. There we go. Okay. So, go back over here. I'm determined to finish these last five. And it's cool that we can make tofu now, too. So, if we kind of run out of other food, we can make that instead. So, firm tofu uh, uses... Uh, why did I not make more? Hold on. What am I missing? Oh my god, I hit the right button. Okay, up there. So, five more mayo. We need to put the juicer or this presser over there. So, let's go to the crafting table real fast. And we'll be good to go. Awesome. So we managed to make what we need. There we go. It's so annoying. I hate that it does that single recipe thing. One more. All right, guys, we did it. And we now have soy milk, which can make Monte Crisco's, uh, probably a bunch of bread and cakes and stuff. Yeah. Cool. All right. That's going to do it for today's episode, though, guys. Hope everybody has a great day. This is iJevin. Peace out.